Hello kids, Steve coming right back at you for Saturday Morning Cartoons. We have a good lineup today from 1987 right up to 2023. Got a few wax packs, got a few, um, uh, what do you want to call them, foil packs, you even have a box. Yeah, that's right, this here pack, every pack is a box. So we'll start off with the newest first. Let's try Garbage Pail Kids Chrome. And see if we can pull anything out of the OS6. A lot of people have been. It's been exciting to open and to watch be opened. So let's see what Steve does. We have Airhead Jed. That's a B variant. Oh, Peg and Megan. That's a B variant. Loose Spring is a B variant. Pretty cool. We have Paddlin Madeline. That's a B variant. Oh, nice. Cracked ice, or we like to call them the silver sapphire. Oh, and we made it 100%. It's a B variant. Shrill Jill. Very cool. Very, very cool. So, so far, we have a winner. We have a cracked ice. Let's get into the wild card or the Civil War card set again the pack itself is a box which in and of itself has not been seen too much the only other ones i have packaged like this in the box are coca-cola cards now flare flare were in the box but it was a two-parter that you pull this off and you come out blah 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 you know it so let's see here these are from 2000. The first thing we get is Assassin's Reward poster. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> that is really cool. Hey, John Wilkes Booth. Let's see who are the other two up there. Harold and Surratt. Not sure who they were, or what part they played in the assassination of our beloved President Abraham Lincoln. But that is actually kind of cool. I like that. Let's see what the cards are like now. At the very back end, we have the Baltimore Riots. All right. Take that, Baltimore. Coming up with Belle Isle Prison. And the back of everyone has a very lengthy description and tell all about the front. The next card is Dear Sarah, July 14th, 1861, um, by Mayor Sullivan Ballou. Huh, these are actually nice cards. Nice, thick stock. I like the dual flag for the north and south that's awesome this one's a little hard to read it is called lincoln's assassination april 14 1865 oh a tragedy at ford's theater that could be a little graphic the gun is already going off and there's lincoln good lord <laughs> i like these these are pretty cool next up we have Profile of Fortification. Nice. And finally, well, that's an interesting card. Huh. Okay, it's called Famous Units Subset Divider Card. So when you're making the set, you put this in there to separate the first 20 cards of a subset the next ones huh see back for details and it tells what they all are and what the card numbers are it's kind of like the most ridiculous checklist i've ever seen bud all right these are actually pretty pretty cool well now let's get into something we have seen before a guinness book of world records by pro set 
Now, obviously, I'm enamored by the card of the Packers in the Ice Bowl. I like the $1,000 bill card because, well, I'm into money, if you've been watching Mondays. And apparently, Alexa thought I said her name. So, she's quiet now. We have... For Height Flyers in a Hurry. Nice. I'm assuming that's just a big ass something or other. Commercial aircraft. Alrighty. Coming up, we have Young Majesty. I'm going to guess that would be probably one of the youngest royals. Yep, King of Sw Swaziland. He was 18 years and six days. No way out. Looks like San Francisco, and I think that is still their motto today. Yep, San Francisco Bay. We have the Mini Winnie. It's a mini horse, not a dog. World's smallest breed of horse is the Falabella. Of Argentina. Real little horse. Oh, longest hair. Seen that one before. Boy. Yokozuna had nothing on him. Wow. They just call him a belt buster. I call him goddamn fat. Well, he does have the world's largest waist, or he did. Um, it says his generous waist stretched the tape measure to an incredible 119 inches or 9 feet 11 inches. They call that generous? A rock record, the world's largest one piece rock. Seen that before? We've seen the heavens above, the tallest church or steeples. We have blink and miss it. Daytona, how fast do they go? Oh, sweet. Bears on a roll. Okay, we got a sports card. Yada, yada, yada. Okay. Okay, so the record is um let's see greatest number of consecutive victories in NFL history is 18 Chicago featured achieved it twice and once each by the Miami Dolphins they're the only ones to do it in one season obviously San Francisco 49ers and the 21 through 23 Canton Bulldogs were undefeated in 25 games, but three of them included ties. So there we go. Not a whole lot of greatness in there, but you know, not bad, not bad at all. Next up, we have Desert Storm, the Yellow Shield. Let's take a gander. Oops, and that was sealed better than normal. That ripped immediately. No gum. And the sticker is Department of the Navy, United States of America. To all you Navy vets out there, nice. We get wearing the gas mask. And when I say yellow shield, I mean that right there. The first run of Series 1 had brown, but then it blended in too much, and they immediately changed to yellow that you could see. So the brown are worth a lot more money. State-of-the-art stealth fighter bomber. State-of-the-art then now does is fly by stadiums for football games, NASCAR races, and the like. USS America. <laughs> the Pentagon. Wonder why they named it that. Aegis Control Center. I think I said it right. Lining up the tanks. I see a tank. I, well, I guess one tank sitting out there is in a line of itself. Ooh, that's a cool shot of the Tomahawk missile in flight. How'd you like to be the cameraman getting that one? 
because they didn't have drones back then that I'm aware of. An F-18 awaits to fly. Looks like at least three of them do. Let's get them boys up there and get us some, some, you know, kills. And how about going back to the new hit movie, Harry and the Hendersons. These are fun cards. I never saw the movie. But yeah, I've got a few of the autographs from the 2013 Top 75th Anniversary set from the teenage girl and the young boy from this movie. They're sitting right over there. You've seen them before. I probably don't have to bring them out. Unless you think I do. Da, 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 da. There's the girl. Da, 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 da. And there's the boy. Along with Will Robinson. Of course you have the Reverend Al Sharpton. Look, it's Polly and Howard the Duck. Hey, it's Potsy Weber and Russell Johnson. Rest in peace, buddy. Of course, you have to have a bench warmer in there, some Star Trek, a couple of Dawn Whales. Rest in peace, my lady. A couple of Sabretooth, a couple from American Gladiators. You know, I collect all kinds of stuff, guys. You know this. So let me put these back, sorry. And we'll get into Harry. We'll take the gum out. It doesn't look bad, but I'm not going to eat it. <clears throat> All right, we have George Strikes Back. <laughs> Director William Deere. Bigfoot Showdown. Aww. Portrait of Harry, and the backs just again tell a little bit about the movie. Hey, we got a sticker of the Bigfoot Showdown. That's kind of cool. Harry looks for George. We have panic in the streets with looks like John Lithgow. Yes, it is John Lithgow. Goodbye, old friend. Goodbye, kiss from Nancy. Got her autograph. Yeah, I think that's the kid I got the autograph from also. And don't think I'm crazy, but it's Bigfoot. All right. Hey, guys. Again, this was fun. I do really enjoy doing Saturday morning cartoons with you. I hope you enjoy them as much as I do. I've got a lot of stuff open a lot of stuff you've not seen before uh, whatnot has been keeping my uh, mind busy and wallet empty so that's good for entertainment purposes later on today i will be going to a sport card show with autograph guest dante hall remember him from uh what was it 15 20 years ago with the chiefs i think he had eight um, return touchdowns in one season to set a record and was really good and stuff. So me and Origami Folder will be seeing him. Um, other than that, you know, Sunday shout-outs tomorrow. Then we'll be back and settle again on Monday. So, hey, all just be excellent to each other. Always treat others the way you want to be treated. Above all else, peace.